Dimitri has some surprising news, my lovelies. Yes, he does. Welcome back to the Tracy Trendy Show. Welcome back, my lovelies. The surprise is he claims to be homeless. Dimitri claims to be homeless. Yes, he does. Mm -hmm. He is so homeless that he's reaching out to people he owed debt to to repay them. To repay them. I mean, I'm trying to figure out the logic in all of that. Why are you reaching out to people? Use the people who owe people money, they, they dodge them. But here, Dimitri, our good Dimitri, is, is just saying, hey, I'm homeless. I want to repay the debt that I owe you. Okay? Let me read his, his email. Let me read it. It goes like this. It says, I'm reaching to let you know that my objective is to still pay what I owe you and that I have not forgotten. I've been homeless and trying to rebuild, but wanted to ask, is there anything I can do to offset work off my debt to you? For example, come to work on the farm, build or fix the website. Any type of work you need, a body slash mind for that I can provide, I'm willing to help and do anything possible to help with intention and gratitude Dimitri Snowden, trademark name. Be grateful, stay grateful. All right. There's a lot of things to unpack in this email, okay? It comes across a little like, what could your body and mind, what do you, who wants to use your body and mind? Dimitri, if you've got the mind working, why don't you go do your tech? Go get an IT job. They're plentiful. Go do that. Now, some people think he's dumb and, and broke and all that stuff. I don't think Dimitri's dumb. Mm -mm, mm -mm. He's, he's 41 years old or something like that. He's lived quite long like this. Okay, it takes some form of intelligence to outwit others. It does. You know, he has used his brain for not the best of things, but I don't think he's dumb. I think he's a little touch in the head, but I don't think he's dumb. I think he's running low on his luck. I think he's running low on his luck. He needs to go back to his roots and do that IT job where he met uh, Ashley. Just go back to IT. Just do that. You can work from home in IT. So I don't know why he does not want to work. He may have a screw loose. He may have a screw loose. But another thing, why are you offering to repay debts? Usually people who want to repay debts and they don't have any money, they get running in the opposite direction for the people they owe money to. That's what they do. That's why I don't owe money out to people. Because I learned that those people will run the opposite direction and then cop an attitude when you're asking for your money back. So, Demetrius doing the totally opposite thing. He's knocking on doors. Well, Emails, sent out two emails actually to two people. Said, I want to repay you, but I don't have the money. I am homeless. Okay. I, he said, I. So it seems like Ashley's not with him anymore. I don't know. If you look at Ashley's um, latest word salad in her IG post, because she used a lot of stuff to talk about this, that, and the other. She mentions saying, oh, it did not pull up on here. Oh, it, didn't, it didn't pull up. But she mentions things about her being, you know, separate and free and all that stuff. She uses those types of words in her IG posts. Freedom, you know, I'm separated from my old self and blah, blah, blah. I'm going to leave it on the screen for you to read because it's not pulling up right now. I didn't post it on my trusty Samsung. So that's interesting. So Ashley probably went back to live with her mama. She took the kids and everything. If I'm to assume that, you know, that she's not with Dimitri because he mentioned that he is homeless, not his family. Another thing to unpack, my lovelies, another thing to unpack is, as I said, I don't think Dimitri's done. 
No. He's want the world to know that he is penniless. He's got a, a strategy. Because I'm thinking, Chrissy's out here trying to get support from him. And he's like, I'm, I, I'm, I'm a man of the street. Indigent. I have no money. I'm knocking on doors. Here's proof. I sent an email here and an email there. And it's all over line that I am homeless. I am broke. So, Chrissy, if you're looking for some uh, support from Dimitri, as I said in my other video, he's too smart for that. He's not going to let you get a dime. No. And some people wonder why Chrissy's not going back to South Africa. And some people are seeing the borders are closed. So she can't come back. Some people say there's legal reasons why she can't come back. She has to settle this with Dimitri. But in the meantime, if the borders open up or something, um, Chrissy, you better take that GoFundMe money and get your plane tickets and go back home the second the border opens. Because Dimitri, it'll be a cold day in hell before you get a dime out of Dimitri. Dimitri is hip to the game. He is going to play broke. Okay? That's what he's going to play broke. All right, so you out in the street, you're homeless. You got access to a computer, a phone or something? Who's playing for that phone bill? Who's playing for that internet? So Dimitri's out there claiming homeless. And this man hasn't been working a full-time job in years. He's too slick. And people just giving him money. He's conning people. And I, you know what? I'm not even going to say he's conning people. Because at this point, if you're dumb enough to give your money to Dimitri, then more power to Dimitri. Can't be playing stupid all the time. You can't play that dumb card. Fool me once. Fool me twice. You ain't going to fool me anytime when it comes to Dimitri. So if anybody want to give Dimitri a dime, don't run to John Yates or anybody else saying you got scammed by him. Okay? Dimitri is doing his thing. And I think he does a little side thing. I think he pockets his money. I wouldn't be surprised if he has an offshore account. I would not be surprised by anything Dimitri does. Dimitri has been taking trips around the world. He has had uh, valet service from all this, uh, from the Instagram thing. He's been living high on the hog for a very long time. He has money set aside. TLC's giving him money. And it's not, he's not getting in the bare minimum. He, he and Ashley's been on that show for three years. They have been the hallmark. They have been the face of the show. Okay. They were the, you know, when they were advertising Seeking Sister Wife, you saw Ashley and Dimitri as the face of the franchise. So they, they're not getting the bare minimum that Sharp Entertainment, that's the production company that sells to TLC, usually gives to their participants on the show. So I think Ashley and Dimitri were probably getting that house rent paid for, and maybe they were getting 10000 or so per episode because they were the face of the franchise. And I don't know if they how much they kept of that money. But I know for a fact, um, Devin said, um, you know, Devin from 90 Day Fiance, who, all, you know, Sharp Entertainment produces that show too. She said, yeah, they start you cheap. But if you're like the big star of the show, you get a little bit more change. Because you're bringing in more viewers. And that's how it works, people. That is how it works. So I don't know, did Dimitri let... Ashley handled the money while he was out there scamming and, and then working legitimately too. I think he did a little bit of everything. I think he's a little bit of everything. So I feel sorry for Chrissy, but at this point, cut your losses. So whenever the, if it's true, the South African border is closed, second it opens, you rush, you run for the border with your two girls. Cause at this point, you're not going to get a dime out of Dimitri. Do I believe Dimitri is broke? No. No, 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 no. Lower in cash, perhaps. But if he just does his IT thing, he'll be back on his feet. Stay away from the scamming. He'll be fine. There's a lot of money to be made on this internet. And he's a bright man, believe it or not. I mean, he does some crazy stuff. Now, he can be smart and crazy, too. There's no limit on what is going on with him. A deviant by choking women. Um, crazy by doing all these stupid scams and brilliant at the same time. 
What do you guys think of all that, my lovelies? Drop me a line in the comments section, okay? Is this, are you surprised that he's homeless? Are you happy he's homeless? Because if he's homeless, he can't get Chrissy a darn dime. But that might be, you know, a bad for him and bad for her. I don't know, you know. But anyway, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Hit the notification bell because I got some tea to pour on all of these other sister wives and it is some tea. You think just the Mitri stuff is something? I got something to pour that's not involving the Snowdens. All right, my lovelies, I will catch you on the flip side.